everyone, it's Chad from Ocean Sales again. And uh, today I wanted to talk about one of our best selling products that we've sold uh, for more than 10 years now, and that's our Mulberry Silk Duvets. Now I've had one for years and I absolutely love it, but I'm definitely no expert. So I've actually brought in Jeanette today, who is our Mulberry Silk expert, to kind of explain a little bit about it. So Jeanette, why are these Mulberry Silk Duvets so amazing? Well, uh, silk itself is the most amazing fiber that there is. And what it is about silk that makes it quite unique, especially in bedding, is that it is warmer in the winter and cooler in the summer than any other fiber. And how it achieves that is exactly the same way that it protects the insect in the cocoon. So it's a cocoon fiber and it breathes very well. It wicks away moisture, it's reflective of body warmth without trapping heat, it's non-allergenic, and it is the second strongest of all the natural fibers. With all those factors in mind, it is the perfect idea in bedding. It's also quite lightweight, and because the fibers themselves are long, obviously silky fibers, they're about half a kilometer in length, um, it has a natural tendency to drape to the contours of the body. And so when you move around underneath a silk filled duvet, if it's a long strand silk, and that's a very important factor, if it's a long strand silk, it'll drape and it'll move with the body. So you don't get the cold gapping um, and, and rushes of cold air in, in the bed. So generally you sleep quite a bit quieter. Um, the other thing, and why a lot of people say, well, it, it's the second strongest natural fiber, what does that have to do with anything? That's actually quite a, um, quite an important factor in that because silk is a non-degrading fiber they used to make parachutes out of silk during the war the reason that they did this is it's an extremely strong and light fiber and um, so over the years as you wash it and dry it which you can do uh, gentle cycles and everything but as you wash it and dry it as you use it it does not degenerate like other fibers do so you're not breathing in airborne particles of lint and dust. So that's number one. This is all goes to the hypoallergenic factor. The other thing is that this is silk itself is a very dry um, uh, environment and it is not conducive to the growth of dust mites. So people with asthma, eczema, anything like that, COPD, they're not, uh, dust mites don't grow in silk to nearly the same degree that they do in other bedding. So this is very, very clean bedding from an asthma standpoint. Also, if it's good silk, and again, you'll notice that I lean on that quite a bit, long strand silk uh, is never processed with chemicals where short strand silk and polyesters all are processed with chemicals are not very good for children, not very good for people with allergies. So long strand silk is never processed. The only thing that ever touches the silk is warm water. So it's a very, very clean fiber. Anything and that's why it helps drape over the body too, right? Just because it is right. so long? Yeah, yeah, the, the fibers are anywhere from half a kilometer to, it can be longer, but we're on average half a kilometer long wow. of the second strongest fiber known to man. Yeah. It's, and it's so clean and so non-allergenic that surgeons can and do use it every single day in the human body. Now, they don't have, uh, they don't like to because it's a finer suture, but where they get a patient who is allergic to synthetic fibers, you always have the choice in a hospital of using silk sutures, which is an oh. interesting fact, yeah. Oh, cool. Well, it's really cool. Like I've had, I've had mine for a, quite a while now, and I've always kind of noticed that, but I never knew why. Like I used it in the summer, I didn't overheat, but then I'd use it in the winter, and you know and stay warm which for me was a yeah. big deal because my bedroom is above the garage so my bedroom gets extra cold so i always thought that was really cool how i was using one duvet and it didn't matter what season it was i was staying cool in the summer and warm in the winter that's right and they're very thin and lightweight so for some people not for everybody but for some people it takes a night or two to get used to how light they are but it, it's usually only a night or two and people love them but that fact that you just mentioned that it's cool and warm is really good for couples because always, always with couples, no matter how old they are, one is sleeping quite a bit hotter than the other. And so there seems to be a struggle. And 21 years I've been selling this product 
and I cannot even begin to count the number of couples that have come back to me and said, you know what, this thing saved our marriage. And although they're saying it in a bit of a joking fashion, what they're really saying is that they're comfortable finally. It isn't on and off with the blankets and in and out with the feet, trying to adjust your body temperature. The silk does that for you. That is the purpose of silk in nature. Okay. Is to well, stabilize that, temperature. Okay, that's awesome. I know me and my wife are always <laughs> fighting for blankets all the time. Well, we used to anyway, but like I said, it's gone down a little bit with the silk duvet, so that's always nice because I'm much more Good. of a warmer sleeper than she is. Yeah, yeah. And that's usually the case when they're younger, younger couples. The guy is hotter. But as, as uh, it turns around later in life, where the man is colder and the woman is hotter due to hormonal things going on, and silk is very, very good for that. Okay. And then what, uh, what, what sizes does Ocean Sales carry? Because I, like, I know we have a king, but of, of course there'll be queens. Are there any other sizes? Yes, we do the uh, single double queen king and extra long king or what's known as the california king so we have all that all the bed sizes that are needed we actually do have a few crib sizes but they're they're not as as common okay and then i've also heard a little bit about sick silk pillowcases or is that kind of the same thing oh wow yeah well it's kind of a whole different thing when you take silk and you make it into a fabric one of the most common questions I get is why are silk pillowcases so expensive? When you compare a silk pillowcase to a cotton pillowcase, yes, it is quite a bit more expensive. But when you take a fiber that's 1,500 feet in length or more, it's very, very hard to make that into a fabric. And it can't just be done by moving it. it. It has to be treated very carefully. Um, and it and so it's a very expensive process but a silk pillowcase is worth its weight in gold you ask any woman that has one or anybody with curly hair like myself uh, anybody with sensitive skin eczema rosacea any of those things silk pillowcase is a very soothing thing there is no um, no roughness to the silk fabric hold on I'm just gonna pull one out here Chad this is mine and you can see that it has a little bit of a sheen to it. It is not like satin. It's not an artificial sheen. This is natural to silk. Nothing has been applied to it. And so it's very smooth on the skin and 100% non-abrasive. But also silk um, leaves the moisture in the skin where cotton tends to be quite absorbent and it draws moisture from the skin. Silk will leave it there. As far as curly hair goes, your hair glides over a silk pillowcase rather than being pushed by it. So you wake up in the morning and you, I, I, you probably don't know, but people with really curly hair have to redo it every single day because you wake up you know, with a cone head, where with a silk pillowcase, your, your hair has glided all night, so it's not all out of shape. It also doesn't dry the hair, which is really, really important. But what it's most popular for, those are all the practical aspects of it and it's non-allergenic to the sensitive skin but what it's become most popular for in modern day thanks to a lot of attention from movie stars and uh, hairstylists and dermatologists it does not cause creasing in the skin so you don't wake up with skin cre or uh, sleep creases and, and a lot of us really really like it you, you know i don't know if it slows down the aging process but i'll tell you you look a lot better in the morning Okay, well that's that's awesome. You know, the aging thing hopefully for me is not an issue until a little later, and I don't uh, have the curly hair problems. But uh, that's re that's really really cool. Yeah, isn't it? Yeah, I love my silk pillowcase. Would not be without it. Well, thanks a lot, Jeanette. You know, I've uh, I've had my silk duvet for years, and I've loved it, but I've never known why. And you know, all the information you've given me now, I understand why it's such a good duvet to have in all seasons. And uh, I don't own a silk, silk pillowcase, but I'm going to be picking up one of those pretty quick. So again, I wanted to thank you for taking the time with us today. And uh, for everybody watching the video, you know, if you want to pick up one of the silk duvets on or silk pillowcases, you can go onto our Ocean Sales website. And uh, until next time, stay safe, and I'll see you again later. Thanks. Okay, thanks, Chad. See you yeah. again. Bye-bye.